Today's video is on uniform distribution. In today's video, I am going to explain the problem that is, if x is uniformly distributed in the interval minus 2 comma 2, now we have to find out the probability of x less than 0 and the next one is probability of mod x minus 1 greater than half. So what is given? x is uniformly distributed. See, in the solution, if x is uniformly distributed, then its probability density function is given by, see here, the probability density function is given by f of x is equal to 1 by b minus a, where x lies between a and b and 0 otherwise. See here, 0 otherwise. So, the interval here is given as minus 2, comma 2. So, we have to take a is equal to, see we have to take, so here the interval is minus 2, comma 2. Therefore, a is equal to minus 2 and b is equal to plus 2. Now, if I substitute, then the probability density function value will be 1 by b value is 2 minus of minus plus 2. That is minus 2 less than x less than 2 and 0 otherwise. See here, f of x value is equal to, this will be 1 by 4 when x lies between minus 2 to plus 2 and 0 otherwise. See, got it? So, this is the function value. Now, we have to find out the probability of x less than 0. See, see here probability of x less than 0 that is solution 1 here is we have to find out the probability of x less than 0 and if you observe this one so x value lies between so this is minus infinity and this is plus infinity and here it is 0 this is minus 2 and this is plus 2 so in between this one the value of the function is 1 by 4 elsewhere the function value is 0 0 otherwise see here got it so in between minus 2 and plus 2 when x lies between minus 2 to plus 2 the function value is 1 by 4 so we need the value of x less than 0 so x less than 0 means all this negative part so from minus infinity till 0 so in between there is minus 2 so i'm going to split this one so, this is nothing but minus infinity to 0 f of x dx. See here. So, minus infinity to 0 is the negative part here. Now, I am going to split this into two parts. That is minus infinity to minus 2 f of x dx plus, see here, minus 2 to 0. This is minus 2 to 0 f of x dx. So, here it is very clear that from minus infinity till minus 2, the value of f of x value is 0 and here f of x value is equal to. So, this is our f of x value is equal to 1 by 4. Now, if I substitute here f of x value as 1 by 4 into dx, see 1 by 4 it is a constant. Integral dx is x between the limits minus 2 to 0. So, this is 0 upper limit minus of minus plus 2. So, this will be 2 by 4 and finally the value here is half. Therefore, we got therefore we got the probability of x less than 0 value is equal to half. So, is it very clear? See here. So, this is x less than 0. So, the negative part here is minus infinity till 0. So, I have uh, split into two integrals that is minus infinity to minus 2 and next to minus 2 to 0. So, minus 2 to 0 the value is 1 by 4 and this value is 0. So, this value is this value is 1 by 4 and therefore I got the value as half. And the next equation here I will show you probability of modulus of x minus 1 greater than half. See, now I am going to find out this value that is probability of modulus of x minus 1 greater than half. Solution to, see here further solution, probability of modulus of x minus 1 greater than half. See, instead of finding this one, 
so i'll find this one that is modulus of x minus 1 greater than half instead of finding this one so as the total probability of is 1 that is 1 minus probability of modulus of x minus 1 less than half so we have a formula that is see here whenever modulus of x is less than 1 so we can write this as minus 1 less than x less than plus 1 so x lies between minus 1 and plus 1 so same as in this case see here this is this can be written as 1 minus probability of modulus of so when we write in this form so this will be minus half less than this is x minus 1 less than plus half and see I want this value of x so this can be written as so this is minus 1 in order to balance I am adding throughout the equation with plus 1 so this is half plus 1 so this will be 1 minus probability of 1 plus half is again half less than if I cancel this one this will be x and this is 3 by 2 now we need to calculate the integral from lower limit is half and the upper limit is this is 3 by 2 f of x dx see f of x dx so we got the function value here i am showing you the what is the function value here this is 1 by 4 in between to minus 2 to plus 2 so i am substituting the same thing here that is 1 minus half to 3 by 2 the function value here is 1 by 4 of dx of dx so this will be 1 minus 1 by 4 it is a constant integral dx is nothing but x if i substitute the upper limit minus lower limit see that is 1 minus 1 by 4 times of 3 by 2 minus half so this is 1 minus 1 by 4 times of 2 if i take lcm this is 3 minus 1 that is 1 minus 1 by 4 of 2 by 2 if i cancel for one time that is 1 minus 1 by 4. So, if I take 4 as LCM, this will be 4 minus 1. The value here is 3 by 4. Therefore, the probability of modulus of x minus 1 greater than half value is nothing but 3 by 4. See here, for greater than value, instead of finding the greater than value, I am subtracting from 1 minus 1. 1 minus probability of modulus of x minus 1 less than half. So, if we have mod x less than 1, we can write it as x lies between minus 1 and plus 1. So, if you consider this whole thing as x, so this value lies between minus half and plus half. So, if I add throughout the equation plus 1, so this will be half less than x less than 3 by 2. So, this is nothing but the lower limit is half and the upper limit is 3 by 2. So, the function value here is 1 by 4 and therefore, after calculating, we got the probability of modulus of x minus 1 greater than 1 as 3 by 4. Thank you so much for watching.